Hey everyone, I know it's been a while, but I am back with an amazing fashion illustration video. This gorgeous dress was worn by Mindy Kaling. Let's start by making the neckline of this dress. This one is kind of deep, so we'll make it like that. It falls on the ground straight and follows the shape of body. We will also create this drapey fabric which falls on our hands straight down. This is maybe because the fabric is lightweight and it is not flowing too far. I am going to add shadows on the left, below the bust and at the bottom of the dress because my light source is on the right side. There is this little bit of shadow casted on the left leg uh, by the right leg so I am going to show that too so as to show a difference between both the legs. Her right leg is kind of bending so we will show that by using shadows and highlights. Now I'll add shadows on the face and near the bust. I'm not following the reference picture so you also don't need to and you can add in your shadows and highlights as you want. I'm trying to figure out how to show that stretchy effect that is coming from the center. We'll need to show that using shadows and highlights only. I'm adding such effect for the first time so please bear with me. Add in your highlights. Illustrating some hair. Trying to make this again because what have I taught you? Art is all about trial and error. As I told you, the outfit is taking the shape of the body, so I'll add my shadows accordingly, which is following the body. I hope you know that our purpose is not to illustrate Mindy Kaling, but the outfit worn by her. I took some strokes using my highlight and shadow color from the center, and now I think that this kind of gives that look that stretchy effect. So I just reduced the opacity of that layer and I feel this is good enough. I'm also making the earrings, adding highlights on her face and chest and this back part of the drapey fabric will be kind of dark. Now I'm adding little strokes from the side so it looks like it is stretching from the side too. This is because the fabric kind of gets together on the curve of the waist because of the stretch. This is it for today. I hope you guys learned something new. If you did, you know the drill. Like, share, comment and subscribe. And there is something exciting coming up. So keep an eye out and I'll see you in the next video.